Yeah. Now, in the beginning of, of our conversation, I asked you, who is soul immortal? But what's your take on, as a collective, as a people, the human race, mankind, like, who are we? Who are we? And, and as a collective, what should we be doing? You know what, man? I think uh, we, we say, who are we? Man? I, this, is, this is really the only way I can answer, man, is that we are one body, man. Like, like, like and this is the thing. This, this is the thing. Like, like I, made, I made a post the other day. I don't know if it was a tweet. And I said, I said, when, you know, when we pass away, a lot of people are gonna be surprised to see Hitler and Martin Luther King in the same space. I caught and that. I said, I said, I said, Kirk Franklin and uh, Luther Campbell, Luke Skywalker, and then I said somebody else. I said, I said right. Trayvon and and uh, uh George and, Zimmerman. And, and, and Zimmerman. Yes. Gonna, we're gonna realize that they're one, man. Like, yes. Like, and, and again, this is this is something I'm just now starting to grasp, man. It's, it's like our goal here is is simply to. Again, you know, moving our own expansion, like find out who we are and expanding that. It's like right. if, if everybody if everybody is moving like that, this world will look completely different. The right. whole industrial revolution, the whole school system, everything would change, man. So I think I think who we are is, is to move in that moving that energy. But once we understand, I think the, the thing that keeps us from moving in that energy is really understanding what the most high is. Yes. And, and a lot of that goes back to religion, but I, I think I think the thing that keeps us separated is us pointing to a most high. And this is this is something real dangerous, brother. Like pointing to a most high and giving that most high and uh giving that most high an opposite or, or something that opposes it or right. pole. What right. that does internally, it, it plants a seed to start pl- to start separating you from separating you from everything else. Yes. It, it's like if you don't understand that all is one. Then yeah. it's like you're really not saying you know who God is. If you're saying, okay, my God has an opposing God, devil, that plants a seed in you that there's some separation all over the world. It's like, no, right. brother, we got we got to go one step higher and put everybody in one bubble. Right. Because, because to say that my God has the opposite, you what you what a person is really saying is that, that this is not the all. Exactly. Because if this is the all, then there could be nothing that consists outside of this. Exactly. And I know that sounds like I'm going off topic, but that, it's a seed that plants and you live like that. Yes. So once you tap into something that has no opposite, it's like, man, now I can look at the world and see love in everything. Yes. Even if it looks evil, even if it looks like it's against me because of my skin color, like, yes. yeah, that's bad. And we need to deal with that. Yeah. When I separate from that, man, it's like it's still included in this all this whole thing. Yes. I don't like it, but it's still it's still me. It's still a, it's still a portion of my reflection. I- exactly. You know exactly. I mean? Yeah. You you right on point, brother. Uh, now you right on topic actually, and I talk about that a lot. See, that's mm-hmm. next level of consciousness. That's all. Yeah. That's a whole nother level to man to where when you can perceive yourself in something total opposite of what you stand for, believe mm-hmm. in, but you can perceive yourself in that. See, that's love. It's love. <laughs> that's love, bro. That's what it is. That's what God, it is love. God is love, though. Yep. Yeah, that, that's love. Like, and and, and so. I keep my opinion on certain things uh, to myself because people won't understand it. But mm-hmm. man, some of the people I just keep it like this: some of the people have done some of the worst crimes, violated people in the worst ways. We have to be able to perceive ourselves in them, mm-hmm. and know that we may have a different understanding, be at a different place, but we're not above them. And it's mm-hmm. not like we're above, uh, not capable of going there because they are us and we are them. We all come mm-hmm. from the source. And depending yep. on what's been instilled in you and your experiences and what uh, you've encountered on this path, you can determine which way you're going to go and your perception mm-hmm. of things, you know. Yeah. And so, you know what? Yeah. You know, even like to see something or or somebody somebody that opposes you, let's just say let's just say it's due to my skin color, my skin color. Right. For you to have, for a person to have anger and say, you know what? Okay, I'm going to resist this. They don't understand. They're putting the cage around themselves. Exactly. Because 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 you by you pouring that emotional energy into being angry or whatever or whatever you want to call it, like like that's killing your creative power. Yes. Because emotional energy is creative power. So yeah. instead of creating your world, you pour your energy out. Say, you know what? I want to be mad at you. I'm mad at you. You hate me. Da, da, da. But, you know, right. it's like, bro, now, now you're stagnant with change tied to everybody instead of just releasing it and just creating, man. 
Yes, you know, yes, yes. It's like having a color. Yeah, like it's like you're a creator. You're out here to create. We're out here to create, man. And and mm-hmm. it's like we're working with a, a 24 box color uh collection, but we yeah. saying, man, I got something against uh brown or tan colors. <laughs> so I'm not using these colors. I'm going to work yeah. with 16 of them. <laughs> <laughs> like yeah. you're limiting your ability. Yeah. You, you know, you're really limitless, but you have limited yourself because yeah. of your mindset. Yeah. yeah. It's crazy, yeah. man. It's crazy stuff, man.